furious. I'm too fast for y'all, man. Drop. Too fast. Drop. Too furious. Hello, everyone, and welcome back. This is the Tribecast once again. It is Kenny and Berg, and Berg is doing his ridiculous <laughs> Savari dance. That is easily the most hilarious dance in this movie, hey guys. actually. <laughs> and today we are going to be doing one of the story quests, maybe two. Um, I think but I think for two. now we're gonna go ahead and do Bergs. Yeah, we'll do this mockery of death business. Discuss discuss your dream with Kaith and your cycle leader. My cycle leader is the guy um, from the dawn. Um, we're gonna name him uh, Danny because uh, that's my manager from work who makes sure I'm there in the morning. <laughs> um, um, but don't tell her that I gave her a shout out in my YouTube series, so so I don't get in trouble. But um, so what these are, um, these first few quests, I think up until like, what, level 30, 40, uh, revolve around the choices that you make at the beginning of the game. And with, It's kind of depressing, because yeah. I was really hoping they would affect the entire game. <laughs> yeah, it was kind of a letdown, but for the first 40 levels, I mean, the, the personal missions are actually really, really sweet as we dominate the crap out of these drakes because drakes hate dance parties and hey we're all about dance parties swiftness for all hooray i don't think i took it but oh well i think um, you did you're keeping up with me oh dude check out check this out blink oh that is a pretty sweet ability i like that skill a lot actually um but anyway these personal stories are instances which you can play up to like for your bros um and I mean, you can do them solo. It's not. It's not undoable by any means. It's actually quite easy, but it's it's always more fun to just share those experiences with your friends, like they are, like they are in most games. I'm I'm a big proponent of multiplayer games. So, do we have to go inside the grove for this? I, one? I think we do have to go in the grove. All right. Back to the back to the tree, the pale tree. You guys tree. can. Experience my horrendously long load times third hand. <laughs> I'll say third because you're doing it through Berg and not me. Yeah, my load times are probably going to be pretty bad. You'll actually probably beat me because my internet really? is horrendous. Oh, yeah. I did. Yep. Uh, Maybe we're stuck loading? So we're stuck looking at this sweet cover art, which isn't actually all that bad. But Oh, there we go. Oh, no. Oh. Ah, right. Maybe. Now we're yeah. in. And we're gonna unlock some waypoints as we go through this, and cities have their their own exploration um, as well. I don't think it's quite as rewarding as exploring like a high level area or zone or whatever you want to call it. You get sick tons of experience for doing it at low levels, though. <laughs> oh, really? For if you do all the cities, yeah. Oh, nice. Might we might or I might have to do that. We won't do that on camera because it's actually really boring. But it's true. Map exploration is not the most exciting thing in the world, but it is. Are we taking this elevator? Yeah. Yep. The seed elevator. So far, you have elevators? Yeah. That's not even an elevator. It flies. Yeah, it's fine. It's a fly evader. It's like the it's like Willy Wonka's elevator. Willy Wonka. Willy Wonka. What was Willy Wonka's elevator called? Did uh, it even Wonka have a name? It was the Wonka Vader, dude. Oh, okay. Are you high? Maybe. All right. Better not be. Yes, enter the instance. Yep. All right, Mockery of Death. I have no idea what we're doing. I've <laughs> never played a Silvari before, and I've never watched any videos on it. So, we're going in blind. <laughs> I don't remember this. Oh, so, so let's Normally, though, your first one is kind of just talking to your factions. Leader, oh, so though, I'm not going to do anything? Is that what you're trying to tell me? Not right now. Oh, okay. Let's see what old Cave has to say. Uh, here we go. This is really quiet, so you, you guys are just going to be stuck listening to me and Kenny and reading subtitles. <laughs> oh, really? I was life. being quiet because I was hoping they could hear it. These oh, are actually really cool, I, I should, think. I should turn it up next time. I'll make sure to do that. I'm sorry, guys. I'm so sorry. She seemed invincible. God, I look so cool. Oh, who's that? That is Aifa of the Dawn, I guess. Aifa. 
That's a, that's a weird name. Strange name. So is Burgo, though. So. Oh, no. Good point. <laughs> Fit right oh, in. dude. What? I was thinking about it yesterday, and you shouldn't have named him Burgo. You should have brought back El Burgo Magnifique. No. <laughs> He's dead to me. <laughs> For those of you who don't know, which is probably all of you, Berg had a Mesmer in Guild Wars. And I think it was, what, only like level 11? 13, Kenny. 13, and I it was named El Burgo Magnifique. Is El Burgo Magnifico, bro? Is my Magnifico, nick- that was it. My Burgo Magnifico, you're right. But that's that's no excuse for the garbage that I pulled. Now what are we doing here? Investigate the disturbance? Here, I'm going to turn the old, the old volume up here for so people can hear what's going on. Um... I won't there we go. You do this. I won't live without my beloved. So be it. As Ventari teaches, I think these two are gay. Hard ground, oh. <laughs> stronger roots. Just throwing that out there. Here, let's lighten the mood. Apparently, from what I grasped, this dude named Bersalek over here got challenged by this dude Elidus, and Bersalek won. Oh, dude, He's I don't want to fight Bersalek. He looks sweet. He's trying to kill this Elidus dude. And his really, really good BFF, Dagdar, is trying to stop it, I think. Dude, this person... I don't want to challenge this guy. He looks cool. I'm at your service. All right, let's talk to this let's go, man. Joker. And the volume is up so we can listen now. Woohoo! <clears throat> A knight in full armor attacking defenseless innocents? That isn't right. Why don't you fight me instead? Oh! I'd love to. I've killed many in my quest to find the exceptional individual who can defeat me. <laughs> I doubt you're it, but we'll fight anyway. Yeah, right. We have cool. His armor actually looks pretty sweet. Thing. Yeah, it looks really cool. Come on, Green Knight Fate guy. Knight. Challenge me in my chaos armor. You won't. Oh. God, I'm dominating him already. Cast. This guy's a chump. Don't worry about it. Watch, you can't yeah, even touch just... me. You're attacking my illusions, you dumb dumb. He's just and all sorts of on fire, fire, burning. Oh, you guys are new. Noob alert, noob alert. Green Knight. Oh, a second time? What? What is this garbage? Jeez. Is it because we have two players? Maybe. I don't, I don't know. know. I, don't think I don't know. I didn't do Green Knight. My guy was the stag. Oh. So you got to fight a bunch of deer and stuff? Is that what you're saying? No, actually, I think I had to rescue one from the Nightmare Court, was how oh. it went. Nightmare Force. Chaos Stone! You know, unless we're going into a cutscene real quick. What a waste of time. Must be cheating to beat him again. Oh, what? Um, so we're battling an NPC hacker. <laughs> He's harvesting <laughs> the resources. He's flooding the market with surplus supply. Um, and teleporting around the map. This guy is tough. Maybe he's just a tough customer. Oh my goodness! Oh, there we go. Okay. Binding roots. Good try, but you're no match for me, Weed. You did well enough, but I'll leave you alive for now. But I'll be back. The next time we fight, try to get those roots out of here. Or I'll make sure to finish what I started here today. Oh. He is not cool. What a jerk! I'm gonna kill him. He is not a friend. My deepest thanks. Eladis is everything to me. Oh. Your courage saved us both. So Who was that knight in the green armor? Progressive. I saw him in my dream before I awoke. I recognized him as easily as if we had met before. Bersalak. He's terrible. He challenges young Silvari to duels and then fights them to the death. When Bersalak insulted my honor, Eladis had no other option. <laughs> He loves me, after all. Oh, jeez. That sounds mm. like a cat taking advantage <laughs> of mice. He's prideful, and he's a bully. He deserves to be taught a lesson full of bruises. Oh. That's it. Bring it. Let's the do it. of your dream. Like mice, young Silvari fight Bersalak with no hope of winning. But you are different, Valiant. You can do more than just throw yourself on his claws. That's right. Perhaps I can help you after all. Bursalak is wooing a valiant named Garraway. Unsuccessfully, I might Wooing. Have. She's been seen near Morgan's Spiral. Uh-oh. That is helpful, Dagdar. Thank Go get you. get you some. I'll visit Garraway and ask for her story. Perhaps Bursalak told her a weakness I can use. So this is Bully Intervention 101. Is she going to go get with that? 
<laughs> we'll see. Uh, what what gloves should I pick up? Vitality, toughness, or power? Uh, personally, I'd pick power. But it is power, gold. power it is. Why not? And we get a salvage kit along with that. I hear adventure coming. And did we level up? I don't know. Did you? I don't think quite yet. No, just just shy, just shy. Oh, All right, Kenny, are... let's let's go do yours now. Let's go do mine. All right. Yeah. I have to figure out a way to get the lion's arch, but there should be a portal up here. I think. Oh, okay. Oh, this is kind of cool, actually. Look up real quick. Once I have to Dude, load like... first, because I'm a noob. Oh, right. that's right. When you get out, come up yeah. this ramp over here and kind of look up. And there's all these really cool, like, particle effects up here. Oh, yeah. like const They look almost like constellations. Yeah, that's actually what I was thinking. It was stars and stuff. What is, this, really the... cool. what is this? The galaxy? Jeez. The grove, actually, whereas I don't really like the Silvari very much, time. might be one of the coolest starting cities just because of this. Yeah. Or capital sure. cities, I guess. Hey, I leveled up, yay. Oh, here we go. Ooh. Speed boon. Speed one of the cool boon. things one of the cool things in this game is they provide you with swiftness buffs in every city to kinda help you get around faster, so that's good. These cities are so huge. And waypointing yeah. in cities, like using waypoints to fast travel around is also free. Which is really cool. like It's free if you're in town, it's not free yeah. if you're to yep. waypoint from yeah. say out in Caledon Forest into town. And it increases in price as you get a higher level, but obviously, the higher Sorry. level you are, the more it doesn't matter, so. Well, it kind of does. Picking of the game, it was expensive. Yeah, no joke. Well, let me tell you. <laughs> let me tell you. Back in, like, the first month when uh, one gold for something was absurd. Yeah, exactly. <clears throat> I remember the first night. I, I got on for release. I was like one of the first group of humans to get out into Queensdale on my server. Mm -hmm. We started out on what? Did we start out on Airdon Terrace? I believe so, yeah. Yeah, or Northern Shiver Peaks. I can't remember. Oh, actually, I think we started on Northern Shiver Peaks and then moved to Airdon Terrace. Yeah, we started there. And um, like I remember listening to like a couple like Guild Wars 2 economists. Talk about, like, how if you buy, like, a ton of Karma stuff and sell it right away, you'll make a ton of money right away. And so I s bought, like, 300 apples right away from, like, the first Karma vendor. Wow. I actually made a pretty decent profit on it, so I was kind of set for a while. Um, but beyond that, I didn't really get much Not money. happy. But... Arena Net came down hard on Karma vendors because of things like that. Yeah, no joke. Sadly, sadly. Do you want me to wait for you to get out before I run over into this Queensdale portal, or um, you can go ahead. ahead and go, Kenny. That's fine. All right. Because I don't know then why this is. Then I will meet you in Divinity's Reach. I'm a little sad that this is taking so stinking long, but Lion's Arch is always extremely full of people. I'll probably actually end up in an overflow. But. Oh, I think we lost Kenny. Oh boy. Doo -doo -doo. Let's see if we can get him back here. <laughs>